TBIRD 2000 Real-Time OTDR. The following video shows users how to configure the TBIRD 2000 OTDR in real-time mode and how to measure splice loss. Always inspect before you connect. Always ensure your fiber end faces are clean and inspect and clean both sides before you make any connections. Connect the launch cable to the OTDR port. Press the on-off hard key to turn on the TBIRD 2000. Press the home hard key. Activate Expert OTDR by touching the Expert OTDR icon. The Expert OTDR icon is yellow once activated and launches to the results page. Press and hold the start-stop hard key for at least two seconds to launch real-time mode. The display will flash real-time mode and show the trace. To reduce noise on a trace, you can select the next higher pulse width. To do this, press the Acquisition Param soft key and then the Pulse soft key. While in real-time mode, press the Loss ORL Reflect soft key so Loss is selected. Zoom and Shift features can be used. Select Cursor A and place it prior to the splice. Select Cursor B and place it after the splice. Loss will be very high until the splice is made. Once the splice is complete, the real-time loss of the splice is reported. Splice loss can be higher in real-time mode. If the splice loss is too high in real-time mode, press the Acquisition Param soft key and average mode. This will launch a regular trace to confirm if the splice is bad. To return to real time, press and hold the start stop key for at least two seconds. If hundreds of splices are being done, it may be preferable to always launch in real time mode. Press the setup hard key in expert OTDR mode and press the choice for time and select real-time. When the start-stop hard key is pressed, real-time will be launched immediately, so there is no need to hold the key down. All real-time measurement features remain available.